Hey there, Zach here to show you the new downgrade OS feature in Unraid. So in previous versions of Unraid, the downgrade feature was part of the update OS tool. So moving forward, this is going to live on its own. So let's go ahead and find it. So we're going to go to tools. We're going to go to downgrade OS. And then we're going to see the new shiny page here. <laughs> so within this page, you can actually view the current release notes of the version of Unraid that you're currently on. Now this could be helpful because it could include rolling back notes or any other potential breaking features that you may need to be aware of when you're going down to a version. So you can review the release notes of the version that you're going down to. This is also helpful to review before you downgrade just to make sure that you know there aren't any other breaking features that you may need to be aware of. So let's reiterate the messaging here. So downgrades are only recommended if you're unable to solve a critical issue. In the rare event you need to downgrade, we ask that you please provide us with a diagnostic so you can investigate your issue. Download the diagnostic zip, then please open a bug report on our forums with a description of the issue along with your diagnostics. So we can do that by downloading diagnostics. That's downloaded. And then you're gonna be offered a way to easily open a bug report. So let's create a bug report. And then you'll post in the appropriate category here based on the current version that you're running. So add a new bug report, summarize it and detail it, and also up, update that zip. Close. And just to reiterate how important it is to update those upload those diagnostics, um, you may not be the only person experiencing an issue. So it's crucial for us to be aware of these issues so that we can fix it for you um, and other potential users that may be experiencing an issue. So after creating that bug report with our zip, we'll go ahead and begin our downgrade to the previous version. As always, a reboot will be required for a downgrade or an update, and we're gonna go ahead and confirm this. This will do a little bit of magic behind the scenes and it'll reload the page and then we're ready to reboot to downgrade to 6.12.5 or whatever other version that you may be downgrading to. So you'll click that button and rebooting will commence. Once the server comes back up, it will be on the version that you've downgraded to. Hopefully you like the decoupled feature.